You're watching Veil today. I'm Trisha Swenson. Joining me now, we have Damien Wetzel. He is the artistic director for the Veil Dance Festival. Once hey, again, we are here. So great, great to have you and great the rest of the dancers coming to the town. Absolutely, yeah. We got a great night here. Excited to be here. And uh, you and I have talked over the years about so many different things, but this is another step, right? It definitely is. You know, beyond what you have at the amphitheater and at the Villars Center, it's really neat that you're going into the community into different venues and we have this beautiful stage outdoors at Nottingham Park in Avon. I love this. This is our third year here, but it's just getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So this year we have two, one tonight, one next Wednesday with Wonderbound, but tonight is Colorado Ballet doing a whole lot of different types of dances, kind of sharing with this audience what ballet is today in Colorado. And then tomorrow night they're going to come over to the amphitheater and they're going to perform with all of the festival guest artists from New York City Ballet and American Ballet Theater doing classics of American dance. I mean, it's just, but tonight, you know, this is about community. It we've really is. We've got food, is. we've got all kinds of things going on here. The music is playing. People should just come out and have a good time. Yeah, and this is know. a free performance, right? And, yeah, so a lot of the stuff, as you know, so we got our performances at the amphitheater, which have a huge range of prices, all the way down to, you know, free for kids, to 2017 show next year in honor of 2017. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but then a lot of the free stuff like this, the dancing in the streets things we do, uh, all around town, we try and make sure that the dance festival is there in different ways and a lot of live music a lot of lots of different things yeah well it's also not only great for the audience that comes out but it must be interesting for the performers to get to perform in venues like this we have yeah. beautiful Nottingham Lake behind here and Man, you know it's such an interesting thing so you know I was a dancer so I loved that idea of not just doing one thing staying in your lane sort of thing yeah, yeah I got my lane but I also want to get out there and try different things so a venue like this actually pushes them even a little further. They were saying, you know, they, they prepared. They brought sneakers just in case it was yeah. raining. They brought, you know, they brought all kinds of stuff just in case. But the whole idea is to make a connection. Okay. And we're gonna have to celebrate the beat at the top of this show. You know all about that. Oh, That's yes. our dance and music in the public schools, free for kids, teaching them to learn how to learn through the arts. So some of those kids, we call them the all-stars. The Celebrate the Beat All-Stars are going to perform first tonight and share that. So okay. that's cool. Always so many great creative things going on with the Vail Dance Festival. If you want to find out more and find out their whole schedule, go to veildance.org.